Mmm, congealed fat. She didn't leave instructions to reheat this stuff. So I'm assuming I don't need to reheat it to eat it. Oops, I forgot to do the dishes yesterday. They're starting to pile up. If I avoid using plates, I don't have to clean them. Lego Dimensions Fun Packs are finally going on sale, which means I've got duplicates. I'm not sure if I'm going to assemble the Terror Dog or Dalek, but I definitely want to put the Stay Puffed Bendem Chamello and Cyberman in my collection. What a time to be alive. <laughs> Maybe I will put these two together later on today. I gotta get ready for an afternoon sit down with another person on my startup team to better get to know each other. It feels weird leaving these gates open. Although I have to remember to leave that gate closed, if only because you can see the slightly darker stain on the carpet from where I cleaned up some accident earlier. But if the culprit was likely wicket, it wasn't an accident. It wasn't on purpose. I got a little toy photography in before taking off. Someone left the cake out in the sun and I think Diana ate it. Or as my friend George Jetson says, Two miles, keep right. He doesn't say that though. I just drove past a broken down taco truck. Maybe I should have pulled over. Could have had an early dinner. This is more like it. Allegedly it's happy hour, so everybody be happy. I don't think that's how it works. Certainly not in rush hour traffic. I found free parking and an elevator that only goes up one level. I could have taken the stairs. Hi, Daddy. Oh, is your chin back there? Yeah. Okay, good. Go get your socks on. <laughs> I'm gonna show Daddy the clothes I will eat that got you. Yeah. Ita? Ita. Catch. Are you ready to start your baby clothes haul? Hatch. Let's show everyone what Ita and Ito got you for your second birthday. Hatch. Your birthday. Let's start with these little shirts. A cute little black shirt. Oh, look at this skirt. Oh, it's so cute. Mommy used to have one kind of like this when she was in high school. Okay, I'll try not to say cute anymore. I will be professional. <laughs> I love the little ruffles on the sleeves. I really like this color. It comes with little bloomers or little undies. This one right here is adorable. Uh-oh, let me lock it. Oh, I can't wait for Jedi to wear this one. <gasps> A white tank. A dress with whales on it. This one's really soft. Oh, ruffles. Pants with butterflies on them. I love them. Plaid with shorts. Oh. I love these little pants. I really like these colors my mom chose. Does it look good on mommy? Yeah, it's babies, it's Jedi's. It's not mommy's. Two white shirts. This one's plain. And this one has detail around the pocket and on the shoulders. The buttons sparkle. <laughs> You're Jedi. She's talking with Abuelito and Abuelita. <laughs> this one says super cute. How appropriate. And it's got flower pants. And it matches the front. Oh my gosh. 
I just, I can't figure out which one I like the best. I really like this one. It's got a little heart. I love the coral pants with the blue. This one looks really comfy too. That's something I would wear. <laughs> Some black little pants. It's so hard to not say cute when you're doing baby clothes haul. Well, I guess now she's a toddler. Toddler clothes haul. And these are little leggings. This is the dress my mom got for me. I really like it because it reminds me of the 50s. I like the way it just flows at the bottom. Quesadillas? Quesadilla. Several quesadilla pieces of two quesadilla. Quesadillas. What's the plural? And now I get to wait in the other direction. I found two more BB-8s for Jedi. She'll be able to play with this one sooner because it's one of those invisible ink kind of pin tool play thing book. She may have to wait a while to crack this book though. The Adventures of BB-8. Wow. Imagine learning how to read this way. I've also been inching towards completing Jedi's Beater Vintage Star Wars figure collection, and now she has a Bib Fortuna, who may be slightly imbalanced, an FX-7, an Imperial Officer, and an R2-D2. Plus... A better robed Emperor's Royal Guard, and... An even better, better robed Emperor's Royal Guard, and... Uh, gonk. Gonk. A power droid! Help me, Black Series Obi-Wan Kenobi. You're my only hope. You'll fit in well next to older Ahsoka. Your box came to me crunched anyway. I've placed information vital to the survival of the Rebellion into the memory systems of the R2 unit. What R2 unit? I don't have the one that came with the droid factory. But I now have Kylo Ren's Force FX lightsaber thanks to Entertainment Earth. We've got to do an unboxing next week. This may very well be my only Force FX lightsaber. This series is super high quality. What if I was able to attain the other Force FX lightsabers and hang them here? I think you may want to wait until Mommy gets home and then ask her. Let us put together the Dalek with the instructions. Where are the instructions? I thought these were the instructions. That's pretty close. What do you think? The directions are in the game? I'm still here. <laughs> yeah? Hi. I can't mean that. Oh, I just got you up here. <laughs> we stayed up so late last night. I went to the park, but I was on my own, so it was kind of creepy. Thanks for taking a second right now to tap the like button before you watch our next story and for interacting with us across social every day. Your support is always appreciated, and if you'd like for us to keep sharing our daily story with you, we hope you pledge on geekfamilyfun.com. You'll get even more of what you love from us. Advanced screenings, behind the scenes, and most importantly, you'll ensure that we can keep doing this for you. See you tomorrow!